हेलो एवरी वन वेलकम टू ए टू जेड बायोलॉजी क्लासेस आई होप यू ऑल आर डूइंग वेल ओके सो इन दिस वीडियो वी विल डिस्कस द क्वेश्चन एंड एंसर ऑफ कॉमन पी जी एंट्रेंस टेस्ट फॉर ट्वेंटी ट्वेंटी टू ऑफ योर सब्जेक्ट दैट विल बी जुलोजी ओके सो वी विल स्टार्ट फ्रॉम द क्वेश्चन नंबर वन ओके सो इन दिस पेपर देर इज ए नाइन्टी मिनिट्स टाइम वॉज देयर एंड the number of question was 70 so starting from the question number 1 okay so question number 1 epithelial tissue are always found immediately adjacent to connective tissue because okay so option a lack of blood vessels option b it can make the exchanges with blood critical for their survival and function so here what happen so option a and option b both are correct one so option d will be the correct answer coming to question number 2 a series of functional changes that cause a sperm tail to bend more vigorously and prepare its plasma membrane to fuse with the oocytes plasma membrane is called okay so that is your capacitation so option c will be the correct one coming to question number 3 at gap junction neighboring cells are connected by membrane proteins okay so that membrane proteins are known as connections so option b will be the correct one coming to question number 4 approximately how long after fertilization does impl implantation of an embryo usually occur so after 6 days usually the implantations occur so option b will be the correct one coming to question number 5 which bone cells are bone building cells so so the osteoblast are the bone cell that are bone building cells coming to question number 6 supporting cells in nervous tissue are called okay so these supporting cells are called your neuroglia coming to question number 7 A sprinter would experience muscle fatigue sooner than a marathon runner due to because as the sprinter have require more oxygen as compared to marathon runner, so there will be a anaerobic metabolism or lactic acid fermentation in the muscle cells of the sprinter. Okay, will be there. So option A will be the correct one. Okay, no doubt you will get the. anaerobic metabolism in the marathon runners too but as compared to marathon runner so sprinter have the anaerobic metabolism quickly as compared to marathon runner okay so coming to question number 8 colored flagellated cells that cover large parts of the inner chambers of sponges helping water circulation to continue are so these are your coanocytes coanocytic cells okay so option b will be the correct one coming to question number 9 the corals species that build uh, reefs are known as okay so these are the coral reefs that are uh, build reefs these are the hard reef okay so hard reef that will be your hermatypic will be the correct one So option B will be the correct one. So in the soft gels and polyps, these are the soft gels. Okay. So the coral species that build reefs, these are the hard kind of thing. Okay. So hermatypic will be the correct one. Coming to question number ten. Rhabditis are present in the cells of the epidermis in case of your torbillaria. So option C will be the correct one. Coming to question number eleven. since itl epidermis is the characteristic feature of which of the following organism so that will be your ascaris so option a will be the correct one coming to question number 12 so this is regarding your biodiversity so biodiversity is observed to so increase towards the equator so when we move from the pole to equator there will be increase in the biodiversity will be there when we move from the equator to pole polar region so there will be a decrease in biodiversity will be there okay so option a will be the correct one coming to question number 
which of the following is correct for R selected species? So there are two kinds of your selection. One is your R selection, another one will be K selection. So the for for the R selection species, so they have large number of progeny with small size. If we go for the K selection, that will be your less number of progeny with large size will be there. So for the R selection species or R selected species, so large number of progeny with small size, that will be correct one. So option C will be the correct one. So coming to question number 14, the Shannon diversity index. So it's a kind of your diversity indices. Okay. One of the diversity indices. So on the basis of your Shannon diversity index, so the consider only evenness. Okay. So consider only evenness and option A takes into account uh, the number of species living in a habitat and their relative abundance. So this is also correct one. So option A and option B will be the correct one. So option C where both A and B will be the correct one. So option C will be the correct one. Coming to question number 15, lectins are protein specific to. So these are the kind of your protein. These are specific to your sugars. So protein specific to sugar. So option B will be the correct one. Coming to question number 16. Error free repair of double standard DS break in the DNA occurs by non-homologous end joining. Okay, it's a kind of your double strand break and that will be your repaired by means of your non-homologous end joining. joining. So you can get a KU70, KU, uh, that kind of your joining, non-homologous and joining will be there. So coming to question number 17, in eukaryotes, mismatch repair mechanism is initiated by. So that will be your strand specific NIC. There are some NICs are formed in the eukaryotes for the mismatch repair. So option B, that is strand specific NIC will be the correct one. Coming to question number 18, the molecular basis of MN blood group system in human H. Okay. So that is the difference in carbohydrate sequence of glycophorin. So option B will be the correct one. Coming to question number 19. So there is a table is there, community 1, 2, 3, 4 are there, species A, B, C and D. So these are the number of species found in community 1, 2, 3, 4 and species B found in A, 1, 2, 3, 4 and so on C for the species C and D. So based on the abundance of species in different communities provided below. Okay. So indicate which of the following statement is true. Okay. So option A, community one has highest diversity. All four communities have uh, the same diversity. Option C, diversity of community is greater than community 3, greater than 1, greater than 4. And last option that is the diversity of community 2 equal to 3, greater than 1 equals to 4. So here, so what happened though? The option D will be the correct one. So that will be diversity of community 2 is equal to 3 and that is greater than community 1 and 4. Okay, Here community 1 and 4 are equal and community 2 and 3 are equal. So, they had, so this will be the order of diversity. Coming to question number 20. So Wildlife Protection Act that will be your 1972. Okay, regarding it's the question regarding Wildlife Protection Act 1972. So here, so protects, this is for protects endangered species of wild animals and plants. This is correct one. Prevents trade, correct one. Allows poaching, this is also correct one. So all the option A, B, C are correct. So all of these above will be the correct one. So option D will be the correct one. So Arivada refers to so mass nesting of olive ridley total so option a will be the correct one coming to question number 22 two mutants animals with white eyes were crossed so in the all f1 progeny had red eyes so all the f1 have every will be red one okay so when f1 was self it pro it produced progeny with white and red eyes 
okay in the ratio of 9 is to 7 so 9 is to 7 that is the genetic ratio of complementary gene ratio so on the basis of the information provided which of the following is correct one so option b that will be mutation in in the parents are non allelic so option b will be the correct one coming to question number 23 so antigen antibody reactions detected by precipitate formation on an agar gel okay so that will be known as your immunoprecipitation assay so option b will be the correct one coming to question number 24 the reaction that lead to the formation of amino acids from the tca cycle intermediates are so these are the kind of your carboxylation process so option a will be the correct one next question come question number 25 it's a kind of your matching of group 1 and group 2 so here we have so receptor tyrosine kinase okay so receptor tyrosine kinase that will be related to your reception of insulin signal then n cgmp okay cgmp that will be associated with the receptor guanylyl cyclase gaf gaf is associated with the in inactivation of g protein and nuclear receptor that will be associated with your thyroid hormone option a will be the correct one come into question number 26 met hemoglobinemia is caused by the drinking of water contaminated with so that is due to water contamination with your nitrate option a will be the correct one so next one question 26 question number 27 that is regarding your bias statistics that is from your chi square test so in the chi square test what will be the degree of freedom for the contingency table consisting of three rows that is variable one and two columns that will be your variable two so here the answer will be two that is option a will be the correct one coming to question number 28 when ligand gated ion channels open so it's a kind of your second messenger concept or cell signaling okay so ions move through the ditch channels under the influence of the so combined influence of the electrical field of the membrane potential so option c will be the correct one coming to question number 29 neural modulation frequently works via second messenger that activates your ion channel so that's a kind of your ion channel dependent kinase to phosphorylated protein okay mostly calcium ions are used in this process okay so question number 30 so stem cells that can differentiate into all cells lineage it's it's a kind of your embryonic stem cell okay from the embryonic stem cell we can this stem cell can be differentiated into any kind of your all all kind of your cell lineages okay coming to question number 31 so in regard to the cross bridge power stroke it is true okay so which one each statement is true regarding the uh, cross bridge power stroke so okay so regarding cross bridge power stroke in concentric concentration uh, sorry contraction the cross bridge power stroke pulls the actin filament towards the center of the sarcomere causing sarcomere shortening so due to that there will be a shortening in the sarcomere is there so option a will be the correct one coming to question number 32 Walder ring H A. so it's a kind of field ring that will be your god associated lymphoid tissue so option d will be the correct one coming to question number 33 phylogenetically the oldest antibody so the oldest antibody will be your igm so that will be your here the option a will be the correct one coming to question number 34 so peptide binding clapped or proof of mhc2 so that will be class 2 mhc molecule is formed by okay so that will be formed by one alpha and one beta sub domains so alpha 1 and beta one domain will be the correct one so option b will be the correct one coming to question number 35 the decrease in response to repeated or continuous stimulation is called that is called your habituation so option c will be the correct one it's a kind of a direct question very easy question 
okay so coming to question number 36 the interaction in which an individual gives off or sacrifice some of its own reproductive potential to benefit other individual is called that's a kind of your altruism so option d will be the correct one coming to question number 37 a biological cycle or rhythm that is approximately 24 hour long okay so 24 hour long biological clock or rhythm okay so that will be your circadian rhythm will be the correct one option b will be the correct one coming to question number 38 edta prevents cell addition by binding to the ions of okay so generally cells are uh, there is a binding capacity or adhesive capacity of your cell will be prevented or inhibited by application of your EDTA, ethylene diamine tetraacetic acid. Okay. So that will be your calcium. So generally the EDTA binds to calcium. Okay. So that the cells will lose the capacity to, there will be adhesive capacity of cells will be lose or lost. So coming to question number 39, so the process of dif de differentiation, okay, the process of de differentiation in cell culture can give rise to, okay, so the de differentiation give rise to induced pluripotent stem cell. So option A will be the correct one. So coming to question number 40, so in which type of signaling the cell that expresses messenger molecule also produces receptor okay so that will be your autocrine here the target cell and production site will be production site and target cell will be same so for the your autocrine kind of your signaling okay so in this video we, we have discussed from the question number one to question number 40 so there are other another 30 question from the question number 41 to 70 is there so this video might be probably a longer one so we will definitely discuss or we will definitely make a, another part of the video from the starting from question number 41 to 70 so um, so in order to get updated for our videos so you need to subscribe our channel okay you need to like and if any kind of question or any kind of your answer uh, related to this kind of uh, exam is uh, found wrong or any kind of uh, false will be there you can directly text us okay or you can message okay so uh, so that's all for this video so thank you all of you thank you thanks for watching this video thank you